So as you can see, we're logged into the members area and this is the main interface that you'll be using when it comes to using Trend Builder. So as you can see, there's a whole bunch of options on that left hand side menu. So there's three main areas that you'll be using when it comes to uh, building out your GIF pages and all that sort of thing. So the uh, first area that you will want to dive into is the training area. This is where all of the training will be housed for how to use our software. And that's all broken down into a step by step process. And then once you dive into the software, the two main sections that you'll be using are this create process section. And as you can see, there's three steps here that you need to complete. And then the page management uh, section. This is where you manage all of your money pages and you can schedule posts and all those sorts of things. So let's dive into the creation process and get started. So first off, what I'm going to do is go into the creation process section and then go ahead and create a library. Now, this is a place where all of your GIFs will be saved that you'll be able to use later on when it comes to either pushing them to social media or turning them into your uh, monetized pages. So I'm just going to go ahead and create a uh, demo library. As you can see, that's been created now. So now the second step is to actually search for some GIFs. So if I go ahead and click on this search for GIFs section, as you can see, it's very simple to use. All you have to do is go ahead and enter your search term and it will go out and find all of the uh, most relevant or trending GIFs in whatever you happen to be searching. So let's go ahead and uh, let's search for uh, something funny. So as you can see, it's a relatively quick process. It will go out and find all of the GIFs for that keyword. So let's go ahead and I like the look of this one. So we'll save this one. So you just click this uh, save button here. And what this does is it allows you to select a library to save these GIFs into for later usage. So let's go ahead and save this one. We'll select the campaign that we uh, created earlier. Go ahead and hit save and uh, let's save this one as well. So select the, the campaign, go ahead and hit save. Now if we go to view libraries from here, you'll see that we have our campaign library here and as you can see, it contains two GIFs. Now these are the ones that we just saved uh, a moment ago. Now if we wanna turn these into money pages, what we do is we open up this uh, particular library and you can see our two uh, saved GIFs are right here and you'll see this little cog option. This cog option allows you to uh, build out your money pages. So if we go ahead and click on that, you'll see it takes us to a uh, bit of a form. So in this first section you basically just enter a campaign or page name. Um, this is the name that will appear at the top of the page when someone visits it. It will also be the name that you see inside the dashboard. Now, if we want to turn these into money pages, what we do is we open up this uh, particular library and you can see our two uh, saved GIFs are right here. And you'll see this little cog option. This cog option allows you to uh, build out your money pages. So if we go ahead and click on that, you'll see it takes us to a uh, bit of a form. So in this first section, you basically just enter a campaign or page name. Um, this is the name that will appear at the top of the page when someone visits it. It will also be the name that you see inside the dashboard. So I'm just going to go ahead and call this one uh, demo and then hit this next button here on the right hand side. Now, as you can see, there's a few options here for creating uh, some different advertisement banners. So what I'm going to do is I've just grabbed a couple off uh, Amazon. So Amazon is obviously they have an affiliate program. You can uh, embed the banners onto the page and then if anyone clicks on them you can get commissions for that so what I did is I went and grabbed two banners um, I'm not going to grab my affiliate link itself so what I'm going to do is set this banner location so basically when someone uh, clicks on the image itself instead of going to my affiliate link it will simply just open up the image so I'm going to paste in the uh, banner for the top and then what I'm going to do is add a different banner to the bottom so that you can see the differences. And then go ahead and click on finish. 
and it has been added. So then if you head over to page management on the uh, left hand side menu and then go to money pages, you'll now see that your link has been created. If I go ahead and click on this link, as you can see, it opens up the GIF itself and then it has the monetized banners. So you can monetize these pages with a whole range of things, uh, starting from Google AdSense, the Bing Ad Network, um, CPA offers, affiliate offers, Amazon, literally any sort of affiliate program that allows you to embed a banner on your page, you'll be able to utilize with our, with our system. And now what you can do is you can make sure that the banner or the advertisements that you're displaying match very closely with the content or the GIF that you're showing. And what this does is it hugely increases the amount of click throughs and conversions and sales that you're going to get from the advertising. So that's a really powerful way to monetize your content. Now, what we've also done is gone ahead and thrown in our highly successful traffic module traffic builder. And what that allows you to do is build out uh, highly viral Reddit campaigns. Now Reddit is a really powerful uh, tool that you can add into your arsenal that when done properly can get you, you know, hundreds, thousands, or even tens of thousands of clicks uh, to your pages or to other content absolutely free. Um, there is an art to Reddit marketing, but following uh, my advice and using our software, we, we break down the barrier and make it very simple. Now you can find Traffic Builder directly in your members area. There's no need to sign up to an additional piece of software or anything else. We've made it really, really easy for you guys to get access to. So as you can see, if we head back to the members area, you can see the section down here called Traffic Builder. All you need to do is go ahead and click on that. And then you can create your campaign here. It's a step-by-step -step process. It's really simple to use. If you're stuck at any point, you can refer back to the video training on how to set all this up. So I hope this helps you uh, gain a bit of understanding of what the tool actually is and how it can help you in your business. 